Hello, poetry family. It's been a while since I've joined you. Today I'm going to be reading from Jim Morrison's poetry books, The Lords and the New Creatures. The bird or insect that stumbles into a room and cannot find the window because they know no windows. Wasps poised in the window. Excellent dancers, detached, are not inclined into our chamber. Room of withering mesh reads love's vocabulary in the green lamp of tumescent flesh. I noticed in The Lords that Jim Morrison focused a lot on the cinema. This poem talks about the cinema. Early filmmakers who, like the alchemists, delighted in a willful obscurity about their craft in order to withhold their skills from profane onlookers. Separate, purify, reunite, the formula of Ars Magna and its heir, the cinema. The camera is androgynous machine, a kind of mechanical hermaphrodite. I really like that line. Fall down, strange gods arrive in vast enemy poses. Their shirts are soft mirroring cloth and hair together. All along their arms, ornaments conceal veins bluer than blood pretending welcome. Soft lizard eyes connect. Their soft drained insect cries erect new fear where fears reign. The rustling of sex against their skin. The wind withdraws all sound. Stamp your witness on the punished ground. Photo booth killer, fragile bandit, straight from ambush. Kill me, kill the child who made thee. Kill the thought-provoking senator of lust who brought you to this state. Kill hate, disease, warfare, sadness. Kill badness, kill madness. Kill photo, mother, murder, tree. Kill me, kill yourself. Kill the little blind elf. Very thought-provoking. But Jim Morrison was always uh, very provocative. Thanks for being here with me, Poetry Family. Have a good evening.